Well, as Helene weakens over the Ohio Valley, merges with another low, but still slings some rain our way. Although, as we head through Saturday and then into Sunday, the type of rain we get is not the steady, long-lasting rain like Friday. So, yes, we still have chances for some showers, but it's not going to be the steady rain. In fact, we may see a little break at times this evening, but we're also going to see wind. We have a wind advisory till 1 a.m. on the Illinois side and south down to Farmington, Reynolds, and Iron counties as well, gusts to 45 miles, uh, 40 to 50 miles per hour, and Clay County in a high wind warning, gusts 50 miles an hour, maybe even a little bit stronger. Not as windy for St. Louis and to the west, no advisory, but still windy, gusts around 30 to 40 miles an hour this evening. It'll be cool too, temperatures will be in the 60s, rain's going to become more scattered, there may be a break and some dry time. When I say dry time, maybe the rain stops falling, but it's still going to be damp and it's going to be wet on the ground. You'll see Super Predictor shows that little bit of a break, except for areas to the southeast into the east. This is at 8 p.m. And then as we head to late night, another round of some showers comes in from the east to the west and clips St. Louis. Less rain to the west and to the northwest, but St. Louis to the southeast has always been favored for more rain out of this. But here we are by Saturday morning, 7 a.m. I expect it to be dry. In the afternoon, nothing like Friday steady rain, but yeah, passing shower certainly possible. The better chance for rain to really impact some plans is on the Illinois side. This is the afternoon to evening. Here we are at 8 p.m. And notice this band of showers on the Illinois side may just clip parts of the metro as well. But the better chance for rain is east of St. Louis in the metro and to the west. A little lower chance, but still a chance for a few showers. I have it at 30% for St. Louis. Saturday gusts to 25, so breezy, but not as strong with the winds. 74 for the high. Temperatures will uh, be in the 60s in the morning at 9 a.m. to even noon low 10 to 20 percent chance and then we get in a 30 percent chance in the afternoon and into the evening again rain chances are going to be higher to the east on saturday sunday it's about a 20 percent chance for a shower pop up in the afternoon into the evening hours about 76 for the high in fact here is sunday on the super predictor look how we're dry at 9 a.m and look at the rain it's not like friday it's not long lasting not widespread but yeah there's a couple passing showers this is at noon here we are by 5 p.m and even into the evening maybe a passing light shower Lighter passing, not long lasting and steady. That's the good news. So it's not a washout, but there is that chance for rain Saturday and Sunday. Monday now looks dry, muggy and 80. And next week, a lot of sunshine and highs, mostly in the 70s to near 80 degrees. So some nice fall days, perhaps just a touch above normal for a few of them with highs near 80.